someone's dead. It's pack time, bro. No way he just one-shot me. No way he just one-shot me. He had 140 HP. He hit me in the freaking legs. He hit me in the freaking legs. It's the same guy, by the way. Perfect block. bar pack dude get out of my freaking lobby dude guys i think i cooked with this one so today we're running a combination of physical damage reduction and strength on the blow of corruption crystal ball build that i've been running because of the physical damage reduction on this one we are a little bit better equipped to deal with the barbarians running around everywhere in solos right now but in general this build still has all the same strengths that it always does it's really good because you can deal with a variety of different opponents if your opponent is really tanky and slow you can sit there and kite them out if they are fast but don't have the best melee you can run in and clap them in melee if you're fighting a barbarian you can do a little bit of both you can kite them for a second whittle them down and then fight them in melee with your good physical damage reduction. Now, before we get into the build, I would like to point out that only 27% of my viewers are subscribed to the channel. So if you like videos like this one, or if you'd like to catch me live sometime, consider hitting that sub button. So for anyone unfamiliar with this build, the way I set it up is usually pretty much the same in all the perks. And then the gear is kind of what gives you the individual identity. So the perks we're going to be run running here are vampirism, dark reflection, shadow touch, anti-magic we're also going to run blow of corruption and spells as for the spell setup uh, curse of pain life drain hydra bloodstained blade and bolt of darkness curse of pain is your go-to reliable mid-range tool life drain and hydra are good for sustain and hydra also helps you control space you can put it in a doorway to stop people from pushing and also force people from behind cover using a little turret uh, and then you life drain your hydra to get your health back i will say though uh, life drain is good but meds are so good right now that they're gonna heal basically at the same speed or faster so make sure you're like understanding when you should be life training and when you should be using meds bloodstained blade is essential for this build when you enter a fight your pre-buff rotation is basically uh, drink a protection potion drink a health potion cast bloodstained blade and then go in this is going to make you deal a ton more damage in melee and is really the way you're going to smoke them barbs up uh, bolt of darkness is higher damage in the mid range than curse of pain a little bit harder to land uh, but it also has better range. A little disclaimer before we get into the gear though, uh, in order to get decent physical damage reduction on any class, usually you have to spend uh, at least a couple thousand gold. And especially on this build, because we're not using plates, you're gonna have to spend probably four to 5,000 gold to get a good kit with good PDR. Don't worry though, if you still wanna play this build, I have a budget version of the build using only a thousand gold that I will link up there. The only difference is you won't be able to get physical damage reduction or some of the other stats, but it'll still do well. It just won't be like this build. We are building physical damage reduction. And when I'm doing that, I always start with the warden outfit. So this chest piece has the highest armor that a warlock can wear outside of plate. It also has good movement speed and agility for a little bit of extra action speed too. So I like to get physical damage reduction, dexterity, knowledge, and HP here. For the pants, I like to get leather chassis, but if you want to, if you want more action speed, you can go with like a pair of brave hunter pants or cloth pants. Just make sure you get armor and physical damage reduction rolls where you can. Usually even legendary leather chassis are actually pretty cheap with stuff like armor rolls on them. And offsets you're gonna wanna look for is HP, dexterity, and action speed and strength. Uh, I also went with rawhide gloves here just because these were the cheapest gloves that had both armor and physical damage reduction rolls on them. And then the knowledge, max health and action speed are great. Uh, riveted gloves are good too. I don't think I have any around. Um, even a pair of gloves like this would be not the worst, but you'd probably want to get knowledge on them. For the shoes, I went with lace turn shoes. You can go with these 
or like a pair of lightfoot boots, but you definitely want good movement speed. But lace turn shoes have a little bit higher base armor than lightfoot boots, so it's easier to get your fizz damage reduction here. Again, this is a pretty good kit, so I do have double move speed boots here. The Shadow Hood seems to be my go-to hood right now for the melee hybrid build because it has good armor, a little bit of MR, and strength. All of those things are great, and they're usually even a little bit cheaper than Shadow Mask with similar stats. For the cloak, you can use anything, strength, dex, knowledge, whatever you need uh, still to get the stats you're looking for, uh, but do try to get physical damage reduction and definitely true magical damage. And then other good stats again are the ones that I talked about before, dex, action speed, HP, magic power is fine, but not really that important. For the rings, I went with Grim Smiles here, but Anything with fizz damage reduction and then good melee stats is kind of what you're looking for here. If you really need a knowledge, you could get like a ring of wisdom, but I think it's much more cost effective to get additional magic and true magic on something like a strength or vigor base. Uh, and then for the pendant here, I went with a wind locket for the extra PDR. For the weapons, the classic combo, the crystal ball and the Chris dagger. Don't even ask me about the falchion, it blows. Definitely go for the Chris dagger, it is on top. Uh, the Cyclops vision crystal is also the go-to because it gives you all these crazy stats. This is just a, a ridiculous item. Definitely use this if you can. Generally speaking, for the stat prio, you're gonna want to get enough knowledge for your spells, then you want additional and true magic damage, then you want movement speed, then you want max HP, and then you can scale into the kind of bonus stats like physical damage reduction after that. And then generally speaking, I like to get, honestly, this amount of action speed is kind of low. I would usually try to get more than this. 5% is acceptable. 10% feels really good. 20% feels like butter, but you're not gonna be able to get PDR and high action speed unless you spend a mint. And then I usually try to get at least 140 HP with my weapons out but I also probably am gonna spend more on my kits than a lot of you guys, so maybe 130 plus is more reasonable. And that's pretty much the build, guys. As you'll see, it absolutely claps, and I hope you enjoy the show. The Abyss and Skull Tokens, the grind isn't too bad. See, I would fall into the pit, though. You know how in Pyramid, there's that one place where you can fall into the Abyss? That would be me, dude. It would... Why did that sound that like goes right next to me? What the hell? This guy's kind of trolling. I actually don't want to be on that side. I'd rather go kite this way. These aren't all hitting, by the way. It's the freaking door bug. Ow. He's really fast. <laughs> what are you doing shit, bro? Beat me with a torch. Get real. Does he have troll's blood? Is that what I saw on his belt? Freaking cleric pack, bro. Cleric pack. What do you think this is, dude? He's trying to freaking sing on my ass? Nah, dude. What is this guy doing? Get out of my face, bro. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. These clerics, bro. They run, in, they run deep, dude. They're sticking up for their homies. We got about to get another cleric pack smokage here. We get out smite and then we go in. Actually, I gotta kill this guy before I loot the rest.
There's another guy, bro. No way there's another guy. Like, what the hell is this, dude? How? How, bro? Where is, what was it, a PDR fighter it looked like? He had plate boots, so I, I'm actually not that scared of him. I saw that blue pot and thought it was him. I'm not that scared of him running me down, though. I'm kind of slow with this current kit. One of them's over there. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. This might be a TV angle. What we really want is for those guys to fight each other. You don't want to be the guy fighting first. And there's another guy. Okay, sure. I'm sure. This, this makes sense. Yeah, why wouldn't there be another guy? I'm popping TV, bro. Hydra, why you suck? It's the same guy, by the way. Perfect block. Okay, I only won that fight because I knew exactly what his build was. I knew he only had like 110 HP and his weird ass troll build without second wind and shit. Worst fighter player, that's revenge. But the thing is, the shit I have is already so good. All right, well, I still have TV. I want to go try and see what's up with these guys. We do still have this dude. It's a party. It's a party. Mod X, dude. Thank you for the raid, bro. We are uh, in deep. We're having a, a crazy game here. We've already smoked a cleric pack. We smoked a fighter pack. And we got another cleric pack and another fighter pack. All in the vicinity. We gotta lock in and deal with the shit. Someone else just drank a pot. Or was it this guy? Alright, there it is. One cleric pack down. There's a fighter around here somewhere as well. That shit was on him and it's coming back now, so that makes me a little concerned. Ma, dude, how was your stream, by the way? <laughs> Too much smoke? Oh, I know. Go away! Like, how is it on me now? Come on! I don't deserve this! Stupid-ass centipede! Pretty sure this guy is more juice. Let's see. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, we're dropping... Oh my god, bro! Double move speed, purple... Oh, dude. I didn't even realize how good this guy's shit was. 
Dex my this is insane for me. This is ab absurd for my build. But this guy's shit is good too. Okay, not as good, I don't think. Oh shit. Legendary serve bow. And take the shield, I guess. Alright, we gotta we gotta get out of here. There's too much shit. I can't get it all. I don't know if I'm missing good stuff. It don't matter. I don't want to sell it anyway. Let's just go. Oh, there it is. Is that a wizard? What was that? Hmm, I don't like this hallway if this is a wizard. That's a lock. He's running my build! Chad! I got hit. He's running my exact build, actually. Smoking that warlock pack now? How did I just get hit in the back? What the hell? What the hell was that? Was that a bug? Okay, bro. Sure. Sure, buddy. Really? There's going to be a Chris guy right up here? This is sick. Wait, they're fighting? They're teaming on me. What the, what the hell is happening? How the hell... Is this happening, bro? What the shit is going on? I think Barb is a sniper, and the Warlock was just fighting me legit. And so the Barb just rushed past the other Warlock because he knew where I was. He's here. I bet he's hurt, bro. I don't think my Warlock coming is going down without a fight. I think he made him pay for it. Barb pack, dude. Get out of my freaking lobby, dude. Barb packs are for smoking, not for smacking me with a bardiche. Where you at? Where you at, Warlock Chad? Where you at, Warlock Chad? This one's for you, bro. This one's for you. I got you, homie. I got you, dude. We G-walk all over these stupid-ass barbs, bro. These stupid-ass barbs. Person 462 I got you, dude. I got his ass. <laughs> Oh, he's, he's kidded a little bit, I think. Damn, dude. That was, that was so weird, that fight. That was so weird. See, I was looking forward to a nice little Warlock 1v1, and this guy just rushes past you and just straight over to me, like... I think it has to do with, like, a feature where it sometimes checks the status of your desktop. Uh for things like adaptive. Oh, hello. Hold that thought. This guy's fast. Mika Vista. No, sir. Cleric pack, baby. Come on, cleric pack. Damn, nice timing. Why do you keep doing that, dude? You're gonna die. All right. All right, so what I wanna do 
is not get corner camped by this barb. So I gotta kill this mimic real quick. And I'm probably gonna open this door over here. Never mind, he's gonna intentionally push from the low ground. This guy is not the sharpest tool in the shed. All right, now I get high ground in here. That's fine with me. Okay, I'm just missing all my curses though. So this is another good room. Even if I got hit by that, I could have just fallen off to get rid of half the Achilles duration. Right now, because he's going like this, I'm down to melee and he is cooked. If he's using a one-hander, he's dead. Oh my god, he has so much HP. That guy had so much HP. Okay, maybe he could have killed me, but he chickened out. <clears throat> maybe he could have killed me. Maybe he could have killed me. <laughs> but we gotta intimidate him, bro. We gotta assert dominance. It's like a bear, dude. A bear charges you, you run at him and go, roar! <laughs> and then they fold. <laughs> Add the cool shit and then find some way to make it good enough for balance. Multiclassing was a step too far though. It was fun. This is probably a poison rogue. He's trying to go this way. This guy's good. He knows what he's doing. Was he? Oh shit. You're, you're so cooked, bro. We're probably both cooked, but you're definitely cooked. How did that not hit? No way he made it through. Oh my god. Is he here? Or is he downstairs? I think he's here still. Oh shit, he's downstairs. No, not the bat. No, 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 no. Oh Jesus, I almost got stuck. I could jump down the hole. GG. No, 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 this guy played- I was about to say this guy played like freaking mod! This is freaking mod! <laughs> Wait, don't waste the good bandages. <laughs> GG, dude. GG. That what a good fight. What a good fight. Dude, he, he got me last wipe. I finally got him back. I finally got him back. GG. And what's funny is I, I was- I've been saying I was gonna level the road, but I haven't yet. But now... I have a kit 